Here in Maryland, a Democrat won the mayoral race in Annapolis. Alex Dimitri reports the win unseats the Republican incumbent. Four years ago, the mayor's race in Annapolis was so tight, provisional ballots had to be counted. Republican Mike Pantelides won by just 59 votes. Yesterday's election wasn't even close. Democrat Gavin Buckley received over 5,400 votes. Republican incumbent Mike Pantelides, over 3,300. Uh, we couldn't be happier, you know, and I think Annapolis sent a clear message, you know. They want some new ideas and some... Uh, uh, some vision for the future. The past begins in Australia, where Buckley was born. In Annapolis, he opened the city's first coffee bar. He then gambled on a restaurant in a rundown section of West Street. It paid off. It's become a street where locals go. It's become a street where creative people are drawn to. That same resolve that I brought to West Street, we want to bring to the whole city. Buckley doesn't think political resistance to Trump that helped elect other Democrats played out in Annapolis. We live in a great little town where Democrats and Republicans live next door to each other and, you know, we're all neighbors. WJZ reached out to Mayor Pantelides, but he was unavailable for comment. He has, however, pledged to help Buckley. Yeah, Mike was great. He reached out to me and, and congratulated us on the win and, and uh, I asked him if he would be an advisor for me through the term and he, he said no problems. The only disappointment, breaking the news to his kids, the mayor doesn't get a mansion. Alex Dimitrik reporting for WJZ. Gavin Buckley will be sworn in as mayor of Annapolis on December the 4th.